Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Okay, you're good. No more. More? No more. Stop. You're good. Stop. Stop. Stop it. All right, now tell me how you crashed the ship again. Hey. Uh. Okay, so I watched a video last night. I forgot what it was about, but it sounded important. Uh huh. And I was thinking, so uh, we're on a ship, right? Uh huh. And we're moving at the speed of sound, but I'm also spinning around in a chair. So does that mean I'm spinning around in a chair at the speed of sound? I can't understand you with food in your mouth. No, no, but that's the thing. If I'm moving in the chair at the speed of sound, then technically I'm burning all this energy. And if I'm losing all this energy, then I need to constantly be eating or else I'm going to die. You're an idiot. Oh, yeah? Well, what an idiot do this? What? What matters is we're all healthy. Physically, at least. What matters the is the fact that you crashed right into the only Olive Garden within 20 zones, and now the good people of this galaxy won't be able to choose between soup or salad. Not to mention, we have a giant Italian corporation holding us completely accountable. Sorry to enter the conversation, but what if you made them an apology cake? Arnold, that is the single dumbest thing I have ever... Wait... If we replace all accountability with a store-bought cake, they will have no choice but to forgive us. Arnold, you're a genius. Oh, what a great idea. And we can put on that cake. Hey, sorry to crash your ship into your restaurant, but here's this cake to make up for it. Ooh, ooh, somebody write that down. Okay, you two, go along with my nephew to deliver a cake to the Olive Garden. Uh, do I have He's to? He's your nephew? Yeah. Don't you see the resemblance? Uh, sir, this is a radio show. We can't see anything. Oh boy, I'm so excited to- What are you doing? Okay, trust me, trust me, it sounds weird, but your hands are duct taped to keep it away from your mouth and specifically away from Landis' mouth. Hey! Wait, no, that's fair. Okay, well, thank you for giving me this neat monkey backpack with an extra long tail on it. Oh yeah, no problem. That used to be mine when I was little, and now I know why my mother always made me use it. Ugh, why is this bus taking so long? This is the only bus that takes us to the Olive Garden, and this isn't your average bus. How different could a bus possibly be? What the hell is that? Say hello to good old Red 3 food courts, 18 different bookstores, a spa at the bottom, and apparently even a carnival at the top. Ooh, I want to go to the carnival! We're not going to the carnival, Arnold. We're going to take this cake and bring it to the Olive Garden, then go home. But could we at least go afterwards? Don't encourage him! Okay, fine. As much as I'd love to, Arnold, David's being a mean, boring adult, and we can't. Yeah. Uh... What? She was calling. Caitlin. Caitlin's alive? Well, I mean, she's a robot. I don't know if they die or not. Okay, that's fair. Hello? <coughs> Here, let me put you on speaker. What did you do to me? You crashed me into an olive garden? Well, you always said you dreamed about visiting Italy. Why, you stuck up half what a scruffy looking nerd herder! You hear that? She calls us scruffy. Caitlin, I'm, I'm sorry. I know. It's okay. We're taking the cake. Our. Where'd Arnold go? Oh, no, don't worry. He's just at the end of this leap. <sighs> Call you back, Caitlin. Don't you dare! Since you're the closest thing that we have to a child, where would you go? Hmm. 
The carnival. That's it. Oh, shoot. Okay, so there's two elevators. Do we want to take the Google elevator or the Bing elevator? Does the Bing elevator even work? Well, yes, sometimes, but it's also very slow and no one likes it. It has no line. Come on. <laughs> Howdy! You want to set Bing as your default elevator? Zip, Zip it! it. Hey, so here's what we're going to do. Landis, we are going to need to split up. Let's check each booth individually. Do not spend any more than a couple of seconds at each booth. Do I make myself clear? Fine. Arnold! Sean! Arnold! Sean! Did you find him? Who are we looking for again? Arnold! Oh yeah, no. Where else would he be? Mommy, mommy, I want that one! Come on, come all! Who wants to buy this monkey-looking man-child? Hey guys, look! I'm trapped in a cage! Arnold! How do we get you out of there? There's only one way to do that. You gotta get 3,000 Golden Bluxy Coins. How do we get Golden Bluxy Coins? By playing games, of course! Can we buy them? Can you buy them? Look at this boring adult not wanting to play games! <laughs> Fine. Landis, we're gonna need to split up. Play games. Do not spend your whole time at Ski Ball, Landis. Don't worry, I'm not even gonna touch Ski Ball. Alright, time to get that hundred. Dang it, ten. Dang it, ten. Dang it, ten. Dang it, ten. Play again! Dang it, ten. Dang it, ten. Judging on the ball's trajectory and how much this weighs, throwing it roughly that height should get me a slam dunk. Huh? Air ball! Air ball! Air ball! Air I ball. hate this game! <sighs> okay, how many did you get? I... <clears throat> I did not earn any. How many did you get? Uh, one and a half. How did you get a half? I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. You win! You win! You Yay, win! Got a no, ball. David, oh, no, yeah. no. I got all your coins right here. All 3,000 Bluxy coins. I earned them all. I earned them all fair and square. Can I please just get the can and get out of here? Here you go. One monkey-sized man-child. Come on, Arnold. I've been having so much fun today. First, I went to the carnival, then I got kidnapped, and then I got to hang out in a cool cake. So, Arnold, do you still have the cake? Nope. Where is the cake? Uh, they put it in another cake. Ha ha he! 2,000 more golden Bluxy coins! David, no, 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 no. I have your coins right here, sir. I'm ashamed to be working with you. Here you go. Why is my phone exploding? It's supposed to be on set. It's Caitlin again. Oh, gosh. I think we have to answer her this time. No, 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 no. You have to answer this time. Hi, Caitlin. I'm glad to see you, too. Uh-huh. I hacked your phone so you wouldn't ignore me anymore. Do you have anything to say for yourself? Okay, Caitlin. I'm sorry. To make it up for you, I will get you the new deluxe model. Really? Yep, 100% you're gonna get that new upgrade to your system core, everything. Deluxe upgrade. With twin turbo engines? I mean, of course, anything for my favorite computer. Well, shucks, alright. Don't be gone too long. We're just gonna deliver this cake and be right back to give you that upgrade. Are we really getting the twin turbo upgrade? <laughs> you think we have the money for that? There it is, the Olive Garden. Still in shambles, but it's being rebuilt quite quickly. Hello, welcome to Olive Garden. Uh, hi, is there, is there any, any way we can meet uh, Mr. Olive Garden? Oh, you want to talk to the boss man? <laughs> yeah, we need to actually apologize to him. Oh, you're the two guys that told the ship right in the front. Uh, yeah, so we need to apologize to him now. Yeah, no, just... Just go on back. He's been expecting you. I be careful though. Bossman doesn't look too happy. Thanks. No problem. And remember, when you're here, you're family. Ah, I've been expecting you too. Oh, Mr. Olive Garden Man, I'm I'm so terribly sorry for what happened. 
You do not need to worry about that. It is just all water under the bridge. <sighs> okay. To make it up, we did bake a cake for you. That is so kind for you to bake me a cake. That was not needed, though. Yeah. Arnold, give him the cake. Uh, guys? The cake is half eaten. And that half was delicious. Ah, do not worry about the cake. I am not a fan of the cake. Anyway, the wife always gets upset whenever I eat the cake. So do not worry about the cake. It is it is not an issue at all. We're in Olive Garden. When you're in Olive Garden, you're family. Whew. That's a relief. Consider it's just water under the bridge. Nothing ever happened. Thank goodness. Usually when stuff like this happens, they get really mad. And then there's all this whole conflict. But this ended pretty... Pretty civil. That is exactly how this goes with me. Yeah. Have a great day, guys. Uh-huh. Mm, this is the part when you say you do, or have a great day back, or something like that to be respectful. Well, I mean, yeah, but like, we already finished the conversation. I thought it was kind By of By not saying you do, or have a good day. Okay, fine. Have a, a great day. You are disrespecting me. What difference does it make? Your napkins are dish rags and your breadsticks are way too salty. Why do we need to care about etiquette now? You disrespected on me, you disrespected of my family, and by disrespecting the family, you disrespected the entirety of Olive Garden. All right, fine. I'm, I'm sorry. Have a great day. Well, you are still of Olive Garden, though. And you are still family. All that will be forgiven, as long as it's on your way out. You grab those chocolate mints. Oh yeah, sure. Uh, totally. That's that's fine. Okay, have a, have a good day. You too. Did you see him back there? He was like, I'll take a, the mints. I'm not going to take the mint. Those things are disgusting. I would not even eat those if it was the last food on earth. Exactly. <sighs> okay, Arnold, did you learn your lesson today? Nope. <sighs> At least you had fun. All right, so what do you think we should tell Chief Master? Yeah, we can probably just tell him that he gave us big hugs, free food, that whole shebang. I, it's totally believable. He does not need to right. know the details. Yeah. What's the worst thing that could come out of this? Nothing at all. Nothing. Exactly. I think we're completely safe, to be honest. Then, later on, all right. All. So, how was the delivery? The mission went fantastic. <laughs> This just in. Breaking news. Olive Garden has just declared war on the Wesley Objective Service Corporation. But we cut now to what appears to be Olive Garden's mothership over the WOS facility. Wait a minute. Oh no. Race for breadsticks! That'll teach you to never mess with the Olive Garden! Mamma mia, what is going on? Oh, jeez, ah! oh, why did we mess with Olive Garden? <laughs>